What's up, everybody? You didn't think I wasn't going to ride in this rain. So uh, it was actually ice and snow and all that good stuff. But uh, we must ride at dawn every day, 365. Luckily, it's not too cold out, uh, 30s. And uh, we're up here in the woods. Figured if I took a uh, wooded trail, it would block the wind a little bit. And maybe some of this ice and rain seems to be working out. So we need the message of the day. So I listened to a podcast this morning, Ryan Stuman and uh, Rewire Podcast. Uh, he was talking about uh, living life on cruise control. And uh, it was from the other day. And brought me to a story way back. Uh, it's got to be 20 years ago. We were driving upstate. And uh, my dad was uh, driving. We had a custom van at the time, high top van. And I was driving, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, my grandfather's pickup truck. We were heading upstate for the weekend, and we started getting some weather on the road, some snow on the road, and Dad had cruise control on in the van, and as he was going up a hill, the cruise control uh, automatically downshifted, uh, broke the tires loose, and basically put him into a spin, uh, turned him into a ditch, and he was able to drive out of it with some amazing stunt driving. Uh, spun the truck around, managed not to flip it over. I think he was on two wheels at one point. I watched it in the mirror. And I was able to drive it out and get back on the road, and I'm sure he checked his shorts after that. But uh, it kind of was a nice parallel to what Ryan was talking about. When you live your life on cruise control, you lose control of what's going on in your life. You kind of let things happen, and you're not in control. Um, just like that, you know, cruise control basically decided it wanted to go wasn't going fast enough, wanted to go faster, and when it downshifted, it, you know, broke the tires loose on the snow. Just like that in life. If you're not, uh, if you're not in control of your gas pedal, sometimes maybe we're going too fast, we need to slow down. Sometimes we're going too slow, we need to go faster. Um, we need to watch what's around us. A lot of times we tend to get on cruise control and maybe uh, we don't pay attention to the road as much. Uh, we get on our phones, maybe we're texting while we're driving. The same idea, we get distracted. So when we start going through the motions in life, we set our life on cruise control, whether it be financially, whether it be the relationships, whether it be work, um, we start to lose control little by little. We start to lose control. And uh, as we lose control, things can happen. Things can get out of whack. Um, we're not accelerating anymore. Um, really just got to think about that and take your life off cruise control. Um, yeah, it's good to automate things, the, the menial things in life and, and let them happen automatically. But in the daily activities, we got to make sure that we're living our life, you know, not letting life live us. Uh, shut off the cruise control, put your foot on the gas, put your foot on the brake, and monitor those pedals uh, in whichever direction you need to go. Grab that steering wheel and uh, turn it in the right direction because uh, when, uh, when you're living your life on cruise control, things can happen and life can quickly get away from you. Um, you know, relationships, uh, a lot of marriages get on cruise control and they stop trying. Uh, they stop being intentional, and uh, next thing you know, uh, you know, someone's uh, looking somewhere else for uh, attention. Uh, in your business, uh, you know, maybe you're not um, marketing as much as you should. Maybe you're not paying attention as much as you should. Next thing you know, you got a competitor sneaking up on you, maybe taking your business. Maybe you got employees uh, that are maybe stealing from you or doing stuff like that because you're not paying attention. You're leaving your business on cruise control. Um, your finances, you know, maybe you're not watching uh that checking account and maybe uh someone's got a hold of your uh your account number maybe they're draining your account and you're not paying attention um you know someone could be emptying your accounts without you noticing because you're on cruise control and you're not paying attention so so there's your message of the day turn off the cruise control start living your life start driving your car stop driving your ship and uh start living your life intentionally don't let things just happen for you make them happen all right, so let's jump on prayers. It is cold and wet and rainy and all that good stuff, but that's all right. We'll make it through. All right. In the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to uh, be in control of our lives. Help us to live intentionally. Help us to not 
set our lives on cruise control and help us to not exist, help us to prosper every day and help us to make the world a better place uh, by affecting all those around us and our own lives. Uh, amen. All right. So it's a cold, wet Friday, but we ride at dawn every day. Um, don't live your life on cruise control, guys. It's real easy to just start existing. It's real easy to just get in that hamster wheel. It's real easy to just uh, stop paying attention, letting things happen. And um, life can get out of hand. Life can get away from you. So don't let it get away from you. Be intentional. All right, everyone. God bless. Happy Friday. Put your head on a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go, guys. Let's do this.